in this exercise we will make a bolt and we will learn about thread feature thread feature mainly available 2018 and above solid works so first we will make the main body this head diameter 50 mm you will see here radius 25 and width 25 then the gap is 10 mm and uh, this diameter 10 mm these are collinear and this diameter 20 mm and here you will see the length 25 50 okay let's make this then there is a one cutout hexagon cutout 30 diameter and this is depth 12 mm let's create first this one activate front plane sketch activate line tool and uh, let's start from here connect now this is close profile create few important relation hold shift key these two lines collinear because same dimension now let's activate line smart dimension and defined dimension 25 millimeter 10 millimeter and this length 20 millimeter okay now distance from here to here it's 50 millimeter just expand this here this is going to be 25 millimeter and this center one 10 millimeter now look the drawing seems fully defined okay this is going to be balanced now distance given 25 millimeter look this is fully defined a sketch activate revolve boss base feature axis of revolution i am going to choose this line and you will see the preview keep end condition blind angle 360 degree because we want a complete 360 solid body say yes now let's choose this sketch and i am going to activate polygon keep here 6 millimeter uh, 6 number of sides inscribed circle okay now make few important relation these two points horizontal smart dimension and the center outer to outer distance not age this point to point distance given 30 millimeter activate extruded cut and here keep end condition blind and depth you have to define the length 12 millimeter say yes now see here all dimensions in millimeter all threads are right hand and one more thing all specified chamfer unspecified chamf chamfer 1 millimeter it means this is specified so this is 2 millimeter and rest all 1 millimeter then if you check here we have to create two threads first 20 by 2 millimeter thread this 2 millimeter is the pitch length of the thread 15 millimeter similarly if you see this one 40 m 40 by 3 millimeter 3 millimeter is the pitch and 25 millimeter so let's make this now click this point chamfer now angle distance chamfer here 1 millimeter into 45 degree these two faces and this end face okay i'll choose this face chamfer and this is going to be 2 millimeter so same here angle and distance i'm going to select chamfer type full preview 2 into 45 degree say yes now if you want to activate thread tool just drop down the whole wizard this is available only 2018 or above that activate thread tool now thread location so i am going to start from here but here one more condition you will see here 
even though optional start location let's say i am going to select this face why i do like this because here i have chamfer so i have to choose age and i don't want to choose this inside age i want to choose outside age that's why these two conditions offset i'll tell later keep end condition blind and depth or length of the thread 15 see and here we want to create a thread so we will choose uh, not uh, we want to cut thread not create we want to make a pro cut profile so i'll choose metric die m20 into 2 he, from here you can control thread or which if it is not available thread or diameter now this is going to be cut thread location we don't need this right hand thread and uh, trim with start trim with end face it is not work in this condition but i'll tell you uh, what exactly this trim and actually the these options will cut the profile on the thread of off on its past the start or end points so it will not cut into the wrong geometry so i'll i'll see next thread this options if i am going to say yes now look there is a one problem see this cut out edit feature and here i am going to select offset now thread is how much let's say 2 mm but see if i put 0 again i put 2 mm and see the thread is shifting so here we have one option called maintain thread length say ok now it will maintain the thread length from this end to end here also choose offset 2 now look this is going to start from end but it's going to finish up to 15 millimeter length say ok look again activate whole wizard or thread okay now this time i am going to choose this end okay now offset here also i want offset i am not going to choose the second option even though i can let's say start this face but even though i will apply end condition let's say i'll put 30 millimeter it's going let's cut this 40 millimeter okay metric die and here i have to choose 40 now see the 40 is not available so i'm going to choose m 39 into 3 but from here i can control diameter 40 and thread 3 millimeter extrude cut now here i'll show you how this works say okay now again the offset problem here and see this is also going to cut inside or another feature activate now first i'll apply offset and how much offset offset should be equal to pitch or greater than pitch so let's say 3 millimeter or let's keep 4 millimeter reverse now comes down now here comes if you choose trim with start face see this is trimmed but this is mainly works for the profile which is going to extrude thread so we are not going to apply here simply we will keep this now this is mainly why i show trim with end face if i choose see this is the thread going to end up to the face of this say yes look here thread problem solve right click edit material and uh, let's say steel configure apply close even if you want to change some faces 
of this edit appearance and simply add like this say ok don't forget to share like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching